What is going on everybody? Welcome back to RC Car Garage and in today's video, I got some RC news for you. So last week, uh, Tamiya released two new bodies on the uh, for the TTO2 chassis, which is the Toyota GR86 and Subaru with the Subaru PRC. And uh, they released those two at Fuji Speedway. Well, now Tamiya is releasing another new chassis that will be coming out soon. Uh, I believe it should be coming out June 25th when they are actually going to show what the chassis is going to be looking like. And um, we'll just have to wait and see what it's going to look like. And that chassis that they're going to be releasing is called the TD4. And they released a teaser video um, so we can all see what it looks like. And... Um, it's dark. You can't really kind of see what it is. Uh, well, you can tell that it's a buggy, but um, you can't really tell if it's a kit or if it's not a kit. It's probably more than likely is a kit because we all know Tamiya. They love making kits and, um, you know, it helps out the RC hobbyist with, uh, you know, a little cheaper on the uh, price range. So, We'll just have to wait and see exactly what this thing is going to look like. Um, and I believe that this is going to be one badass Tamiya that is going to be coming out. And the other news that I have for you is from Traxxas. So Traxxas has released the Drag Slash, the Corvette Stingray, Fortec 3.0 and now they're coming out with the factory 5 hot rods I saw the video for this thing. I saw pictures of this thing and it just looks absolutely epic guys uh, Traxxas has been hitting a home run with the latest RC's that they have been coming out with and now they're just dropping another bomb with this factory 5 hot rods and you get of choice of a hot rod truck 35 hot rod truck or a 33 hot rod coupe which to me i think i would end up going with the coupe but i do like the truck so we will see <laughs> which way i'm going to go and am i going to go to coupe or am i going to go to the truck we will have to wait and see about that um this chassis this car, the uh, body that's going to be coming out is on the Fortec 3.0 chassis. Um, it is the newest chassis that they just came out with, was, was released with the Corvette Stingray. So now they're just using that chassis and releasing this new, uh, this new body for the, for us. The price range for this thing is not bad at all. Uh, you can get them in, again, you get them in two styles, the truck or the coupe. And the price range for this thing is, if you see here on the bottom, $319.99 for the truck, $319.99 for the coupe. And uh, yeah, this thing just looks absolutely epic, badass. Uh, we got a video here. I'm going to skip the video. Um, four -wheel drive, the all-wheel drive Fortec chassis. Um, again, we all know 195 millimeters has... Uh, wider track, 300 millimeter wheelbase, 11.8 inches, um, 2.8 inch tire diameter in the front. And, oh, the rear tires are actually wider than they are on the front, which we will see that in a second. I really like the design that they have on this. So we got front headlights, we have a mirror here, and the mirror on the passenger side, the wheels look absolutely, absolutely great on this thing. Um, here we can see the replica tires, 12 millimeter hexes, you know, it has uh, brake calipers on there. It has the clipless front body mount 
Now in the rear, it probably just has something that you can like, I don't know, probably put in a slot and then it just clips right onto that. Um, you got your suspension, you have the hexes, the oil fill GTR shocks, um, the 2075 servo, well, here we go, 2075 servo, that was the servo saver. Integrated, it has an integrated servo saver, uh, 2075 waterproof ser steering servo, uh, waterproof receiver box, uh, motor wire retainer, and of course, the uh, Traxxas ID connectors. Um, you, you can, it has a fixed gear mesh, rubber sealed ball bearings, one piece drive shafts, um, center drive shaft, and uh, sealed differentials. So that's what we got for that. Now, let's check here the colors that this, these two cars are gonna be coming in. So the truck, you can see you can get it in a red, or you can get it in a silver. The coupe, you can get it in this red, or you can get it in the blue. It doesn't matter, whatever color you like, as long as it's in the truck, red and silver, and in the coupe, red and blue, you can get whatever color you want. <laughs> um, here's some action shots. Uh, as we can see here with the, uh, with the truck, we do, it does come with rear tail lights and it comes with headlights this thing just looks absolutely badass i mean whether you get the coupe or you get the truck either way they just look absolutely awesome uh chassis details so i just wanted to show this to you guys so the fortec 2.0 it has a uh 66 millimeter tire the Fortec 3.0 has a taller tire at 2.8 inches, 73 millimeters. Now, width-wise, it looks to me, well, it just, not just that it looks to me, but it is. Uh, the front tire width on the 2.0, 26 millimeter. The rear, 30 millimeter. For the Fortec 3.0, you're looking at 28 millimeters for the front tire width and 32 millimeters for the rear tire width. Um, you have here brake disc with a brake caliper on there and uh, we already saw all, all that and whatnot. Data specs. So let's go to feature list. All right, so it does bring a front clipless body mount. Um, it is coming out with the XL5 uh, over here somewhere. I know I saw it a minute ago. It's coming out with the XL5 ESC and the uh, 12 turn 550 Titan brushed motor with internal pulley fan. So yeah, <laughs> so you can use, again, like everybody knows, you can use either the, um, you can use either uh, light boat or nickel metal high drive. Oh, here we go. So right here, XL5 ESC, um, and it you have you actually have three drive profiles. You have a sport mode, forward brake reverse, race mode, which is just forward and brake, and the training mode, which gives you 50% forward, 50% reverse, and um, Traxxas easy set, one button setup. So, that's uh, pretty much everything that uh, we know about. We know the pricing comes out to three nineteen ninety nine. Uh, when will it be coming out exactly? Have no idea, but we all know Traxxas how they basically just wait till the last minute to end up um, letting us know when it's going to be released. So. Now we'll just have to sit and wait. I mean, look how long it took for the uh, Drax Lash to come out. Um, and now they're bringing us out with this thing, <laughs> which I, to me, it looks absolutely awesome, guys. Um, so that's pretty much all I got for you in this video. And I hope that uh, we get to see this thing out 
soon. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, hope you liked the video. Please hit that like button, subscribe for more content, and I will see you guys in another video. You all have a good night.